Silent Hill 2, a classic game. One of the most horrifying games on the PlayStation 2 ever to date. Some will say it's probably the greatest horror game of all time. The greatest part is you can play it right here on your iPhone, running any version of iOS after version 7, most likely 9, 10, or 11, even 12 and 13. Silent Hill 2 is quite a difficult game to play. Of course, there's an option to select your difficulty, which makes things a little bit easier. As you can see on my screen, there's a little bit of a static bar on the bottom. However, I think that could be a problem with my ROM, and you could have better results if you use different ROMs, or even a better software, better hardware combination. All in all, the game runs at about 20 frames per second, which is very playable, considering you're on a mobile device. Even though that there is some static at the bottom here, you're able to see the entire screen area on your screen, and you are not having anything cut out. As you can see, when I go to the pause menu later on, nothing will be missing. So, in order for you to get this emulator on your phone, or iPod Touch, or iPad, one of the ways to do it is to download the IPA, which is going to have a link to the official website you can see in the description. Afterwards, you download the IPA, you need to sign it using the latest utility out there right now. Uh, March 2020, we have Alt Store, and you can do a quick search for that. I will also include a link in the description for that as well. You can upload this IPA to OneDrive and put a link that Alt Store will then look for and then sign to your phone. To make this the least bit confusing as possible, you will be downloading Alt Server for Windows or Mac, and then when you click the application icon in the tray on your Mac or in the dock at the top, you will see uh, install Alt Store. You will click that. Alt Store is another name for an application, and you can add any application you want. It will give you the option to add your OneDrive URL, in which you will have put play.ipa inside that link. However, there is a faster solution. If you have a jailbroken device, you may install the IPA via various methods, one of which could be FileZone.